Hey, let's all play a game of Imagine If. Imagine if I'm a little kid, I love The Lion King, and I want to experience it on the Super Nintendo. Which game should I play? Should I play The Lion King? A challenging yet fun platformer where you start out as young Simba, you become adult Simba, it has instrumental versions of the songs from the movie. Or do I pick... Timon and Pumbaa's Jungle Games? Well, for the negative six of you that would have picked Timon and Pumbaa's Jungle Games, you're in luck. Uh, let's start with a pinball game, I guess. Pinball video games are almost always bad. Almost. All right, here's Jungle Pinball. Do gophers live in jungles? All right, ball, do your thing. Hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Pumbaa's got a circle around his asshole. And he's showing it off to me! Does he want me to hit him? If not, why is he presenting it to me? Is he proud of his ass circle? If that's not bad enough, there's a hippo with a bullseye on his arse! Who painted that? Alright, you know what the problem is? There's too big a space between the flippers and the hole. I'm no pinball wizard, but this is bad even by those standards! And this frog's always trying to grab the ball with his tongue, but he never catches it. He should play for the Pelicans. All right, I'm glad that's over, but what are Timon and Pumbaa doing? Even the jungle fauna looks confused. What are they doing? I don't know, but it looks messed up. All right, let's go to Burper, I guess. It was right next to them. Why'd they go the other way? All right, so this is like a space shooter, only your Pumbaa shooting gas at random things falling from the sky. Oranges, bananas, coconuts, eggs, bugs, everything but the kitchen sink. <laughs> I eat my words. The sink kills you, the spider kills you, the bunch of bananas kills you, but the coconut doesn't. Now, if you had to throw something at me and I got to choose between a bunch of bananas and a coconut, I would shoot, well first, I gotta ask, why are you throwing stuff at me? Sometimes bugs will fall on the ground and you have to swat them with your tail while also trying to shoot stuff that's falling from the tree. This one's just trying to kiss you. It's not really a threat. All right, hippo hop. They did it again! Why do they keep going the opposite way? You know what? Puma needs the exercise. So this is hippo hop. What else can I say? It's just like Frogger, only dumber. In Frogger, the main objection is to get to the other side. In this, you just jump on everything to increase your score. You don't even get points for reaching the other side. Just go around collecting bugs. I mean, what else could they possibly be? You have to land right in the middle of the platform. Now, it's not that I have a problem with that. It's just that I lied, yes I do. All right, last game. Judging from the first three, it's probably not fun at all. But it does have the coolest name. Sling Shooter does sound fun. Maybe we get a gun and go hunting with a broken arm or something. No. You just shoot grapes at pretty much anything that moves. Shooting some of the animals will lose you points, but not enough to worry about. I, I don't understand how you're supposed to know which ones to shoot and which ones not to. You lose points if you shoot Timon. M makes sense. He's the good guy. You get points if you shoot the hyena. Again, logical. You get points when you shoot Pumbaa, though? I don't know. Maybe before this game started, some of these animals may have, like, robbed you or killed your families or something. Um, you know, my condolences. But uh, how am I supposed to know that? I'm shooting whatever I see. And if these animals are bad, w w what is throwing grapes gonna do? Give them a healthy snack? Enough of the crocodile tears. Or is it alligator tears? Which one? No, it is crocodile tears. Yeah, it is. But which one is he? I just lost points for shooting the hippo. Listen, if a hippo makes eye contact with me and he's that close to me, I'm shooting him. I love animals, but I love me more. And it took a lot of confidence for me to say that on camera. Bottom line, these jungle games suck. It's just a crappy compilation of games you've seen before. 
and they knew it was bad. But they gave it the Lion King license and they knew kids would want it and then parents would see Jungle Games plural and thought they'd be getting a steal even th You know what, just go to a real jungle. Oh, I hope that didn't hit the dog.